Hello everybody and welcome back to D Moon Show. I'm your host D Moon and once again we're playing Pikmin 4. Yes. Um stop playing for a bit, but uh I can't remember I, oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna do a night expedition. If the mission doesn't work on OG, that just means we have to do more research. Cause yes, we got to do a night mission. Just to get it out of the way. Just uh, skip through all that fun stuff that we've seen so many times. Danger level three. Now this is number two. We did one and three apparently of this area. So now we gotta do uh, number three or number two. So this should be a lot easier than uh, the first one, which uh, probably showed off those uh, the weird monsters that we saw earlier in the third day from the eggs. Or do those things come in when, uh... I can't remember now if those guys are... If what I'm thinking of is from something else. destroy that thing. Oh, come on, everyone. Destroy the egg, destroy the egg. Uh, uh, is there another egg somewhere? Far away. Oh, was that it? Oh, okay, I guess that was it. Fantastic, there's not a single creature left standing or skittering or hopping. Alright, perfecto. You put an effort out there, new blood. Hey, look at the cup. 
color on that. I can't wait to make medicine with it. Alright. We got that done. So, I guess all that there is to do is... Do I do a Captain Olimar thing? Nah, I'll keep going. Captain Olimar themes thing I'll do like halfway through. Because I feel like his uh, his journey will take us to all the areas. So once I get like the last area unlocked and do like one exploratory mission there, then I'll uh, I'll start doing Captain Olimar stuff. Captain Olimar there is just clapping away. He's probably he's probably impressed. He's like, oh wow, you actually stayed outside all night? Congrats. Well, look who's up and about. How are things going? Oh. Olimar, why are you awake at this hour? I don't know. I just woke up, I guess. I'm interested in night expeditions. As is it okay if I observe? What? Oh, I'm sorry. Tonight's edition just wrapped up. What's it called? Bad timing on my part then. I'll just try to... Just try again next time. Ta-da! Yes, please. You're welcome to observe anytime you like. All right. And then at least if we get one more leafy guy, he'll be back and we're on the mission. Day 32. Yeah, right. yeah, you guys will do the same thing. I'll walk around, look around. Don't think anyone has anything for me, so I guess we'll just go on. I would like to explore the giant hearth. Man, look at everyone there. Yeah, knowing, uh, knowing how everything looks, I'll probably be getting another onion in this area. Most likely it will be the, uh, the white one. Because it's like the white one and the purple one are rare. Purple ones are very good to use. Because they use whatever gravity push or gravital whatever they were talking about when trying to explain what they do. Uh, once the countdown of sunset begins, you won't be able to enter any more caves until the following day. Oh, that's good to know. Oh, there's like a tent over there. Oh yeah, this is like a campground. I see an onion. Or a frolic? Frolic? Campfire. Oh, this is like a, a camper's area. Campsite. Oh. Huh? Is that really? And what's he doing with Moss? Do you know that guy? I don't recognize him from the list of the castaways. It's Louis. He's a co-worker of mine at Hot Chocolate Freights. Is he trying to rescue that castaway? Oh, could that castaway be? Look at those clown ears. It's a crypto or a cop coponite. Hold on, he disappeared! Ugh, what is he doing running around with Moss anyway? Perhaps your employer sent him here to help you all more? Perhaps, though Louie wouldn't have been my top choice. Let's follow Louie, we don't want anything to happen to that possibly Coplanite castaway. Luckily, Orochi has a familiar... Orochi is familiar with Moss's scent. What are you waiting for? Ochi, demon, track, Moses, Moss's ascent. <laughs> okay, boss. Uh, uh, yes. I don't even think I like, actually used the, uh, Oh, 
That was just real uh, silly on my guy's part. Alright, and we'll just toss the rest over here. about that. But we need food for the cause. Okay. They do things automatically. All right, let's hurry up through it. Yep. Oh, one of those guys around. All right, I got flame and stuff that I need to run. Run with me, run, run, run. Well, I got it. Just in time, probably. Alright, I'm thinking that I have to go to the other side. I thought it was one of those crab things, lobster things that you have to. Oh, what is it? You have to, you have to lure them out. But no, that's uh, that guy's a little bit different. Just a little bit. Yeah, move, move. 
the base over here. Swarm that guy. Dig out all that ash. Nothing I can do about it. Man, that's like the uh, issue that we had with the uh, the other game. We died. smart and have only the people that can actually do it go. Come on, come on, build that thing. Yes! Have enough people. There we go. Nice and fine. And you know what? I'm gonna work on getting stuff on that side for now. So I need to go get myself a flaming. Fine cone. And burn the stuff. Way to the next area. Oh, it's a uh, Dendoria battle. I'll do that because that's pretty quick. Look, it's a leafling. <laughs> Dendori anytime, Dendori anytime, Dendori over and over and over again. <laughs> Alright, Nobi. Time to show off your Dendori skills with your uh, leafling. Alright, will do. 
first thing I'm gonna do though. Move my base here. And then enter. Oh, this is gonna be a pain. I see like the conveyor belts and I'm just like, no, that's not gonna be very uh, <laughs> good. Oh, I need a lot of wing Pikmin. Because those guys aren't affected by the walkways. So those guys would be uh, my best friends. Assigning Pikmin tasks they like. This is key to success. Now show me how you battle. So I should leave all the carrying to the flyers. Did I not have a guy? I thought I had someone carrying that. Six guys doing nothing. It's all done, eh? so I can toss. Okay. 
Make it. I think that's the last one, actually. No, oh, yeah, that, that that is. Go run, run, run! Yes. Oh, that's good because of last time I uh, last time I kind of messed up for some reason. Oh yeah, complete. Absolute master. Your Dandori is too good, I could never beat. As I promised, your reward is 30 pieces of raw material. Luckily, I can kill you. Those were so incredible, Dandori skills. Alright, let's get them out of there. Out of here. Actually, it should be there because that guy's not with me. Or maybe it is here. Yeah, you know, here, there, where. All right, we'll do this. Go explore some more. I'm glad that the game wasn't just like three, four different zones and then ended. There was actually like two, probably two more zones to make up for the uh, space that you see. Where you're selecting where to go. With all that leaf growth, there's no way to tell who it is, but it doesn't matter, our job is to rescue them. If you don't want to find the way back into the game, let's put the lid closed as precaution. Yeah, I'll have each. You guys can go bring him. Um, nope, wrong button. Right button. Alright, so I have to like, oh, I gotta burn a spot over there. So why don't I go do that? Anything to make exploration a little bit better. I'm going to check the leafling idea. 
Maybe this time we'll get lucky. Error. PNF 404. Error. Unable to read data. No oh, good. Why do I do this to myself? It'd be funny if like one of them actually worked. It's like that one time. Oh yeah, I got some stuff there. Ooh, freaky. All right, well. Back over here. No, 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 no. Yes. Okay, now let's pluck. No, oh, yeah, that's right. I got a fire thing there, eh? Oh, I can't even jump down there? Oh, rip. Alright. Oh, that's a spider. Okay, let's see if I can... that done. Okay. Let's have Ochi do it because he can carry that peanut with a hundred percent power. Oh, come on, you guys. Oof. Oh, is that the last ones? Oh, no, that was not the last ones. right at the last moment, aren't I? Well, they made it, but uh, they couldn't get the thing in in time. Alright, let's just skip that. Equipping and unequipping gear. You can equip and unequip gear from yourself and Oshi using the tablet gear and skill app. But why would you want to? It's not like you have to switch through gear. At least I don't think you have to. I think everything just stays equipped. Like, is there a real point to, uh, unequipping some things? 
Hi, everybody, I'm back. Oh, leafling! And pup drive went up. And our only thing that we got was birdie bird. No, we got more, it's just... One of them was a bedtime series. Snack bean... Oh yeah, we had these before, eh? Lost quite a bit of guys. We've been stuck in the same place for a while now, Bernard. I suppose that leaves a pilot like you a lot of free time. Mm. Not at all. A pilot work involves a lot more than just flying spaceships. Are oh, I didn't realize. What else does a pilot do then? Oh, uh, well, for starters, I got to store up lots of extra sleep so I can stay awake through all the long haul voyages. Uh, I'm not sure that counts as work. You're yeah, right. And with that, I'm going to end the episode. The first I'm going to go over, free the leafling, and then get the get some skills for the dog, and also see if I have enough for a uh, for some equipment. Who could be? This leafling that I did see Can you help me guess this mystery? Oh I don't think I've seen someone with a purple spacesuit His boundless ambition drove him to expand his telecommunication business into areas like space travel, food, and entertainment Elpin Telecom Company all work doesn't end here, blah blah blah. I say this every single time we free one. Alright, let's go, uh. Let's go find out where that guy is. So he'll say something. Uh, oh, there he is. <laughs> well, well, well. If you didn't murder the rescue pal. The name's Elfin. Founder and CVO of a company called E Leader. But seriously, you're a real hero. I got nothing but gratitude. Uh, anything else? Nope. Yeah, right, eh? Uh, I could talk to you over there, but nah. I just love. S I, mean, I just love science and technology. It makes it impossible possible. You say that every single time. Don't you have other dialogue? Dialogue? What's that? Uh, okay, I think I'll get the thermal defense because there's a few times now that I really needed thermal defense. Come back, Winsty, me if anything else you need. And let's go train. I like to train. Yes, it's fair. Let's get started then. Uh, I could learn Mega Rush. Sun creature, his energy turns faster. Kinda like that more. Increases the damage to creatures. Alright. Good work, Gochi. Reward for you. Keep up the good work and remember no slacking. Alright, and I think that's it. Unless. Do you have something new? You do. No, I'll just do all those at once. Come talk to me again when you're ready. <laughs> yeah, I'll get all three of those unlocked and then I'll do it again. Uh, but for now, I will end the episode here. I thank you all for watching and I will see you guys in the next episode. This is fun. Pikmin's Forest fun. And I will, uh, I hope that you're all having a good day. And if you're not having a good day, I hope that things turn around. You do, in fact, have a good day. This is uh, D-Moon, and I will be back in the next episode, so without further ado, bye-bye and see you later.